Oh, hi. Ooh. Whoa. Double tap. What is this? Can I drive that? Yes, we can. It's an SUV. I'm going to get it. Whoa. Hey, what's going on, folks? Polly Jr. here, and welcome to Surround Dead Early Access that just landed on Steam. I'll put a link down below in the description. You can check it out for yourself. If you like what you see here, it is $15.99. Again, it's an early access game developed by one, uh, one person who was kind enough to send me a code to play the game and share it with you here on the channel. So that's what we're going to do. Um, I'm apparently Rick Grimes, and we are in an open-world zombie apocalypse game um, that reminds me a whole lot of Dead Polly. Remember we played Dead Polly here on the channel once, not too long ago? <laughs> and this looks to use uh, the same sort of assets and uh, an engine. I think it's the Unreal Engine, and I, I, I'm pretty sure it's the same developer. I'm not entirely positive, but that was the gist I got when I read the, uh, the comments and the... Um, on the Steam store page. So not that it matters because it's a different game. And uh, let's go play and then we'll check it out. See what it's got to offer. Apparently it is a very big wide open world with more survival-y type elements. Um, the Dead Poly game was just one open, uh, just one big urban map, right? Do I have a weapon? Oh, I do have a weapon. I got, I got a knife, hold on. Wait a second, fella. I'll be right back. I put the knife in my hand. <laughs> So we have a melee slot, primary slot for weapon, uh, sidearm, and I'm going to draw my knife. And then just stab you in the chest, in the face, and wherever I feels like it. All right, down he goes. What has he got there? Looks like uh, money. All right, and some 45 millimeter rounds. Excellent, but we don't have a gun. So let's go find a gun. Now, there is a map, but I don't have a GPS equipped, so I can't see the map. It is not procedurally generated. It is just a uh, hand-designed map. But as far as I know, it's very large um, with plenty to explore, including uh, urban areas and rural areas and even dead zones. What is this fella here? Is this like a military guy? Oh, shoot. He's sitting down on the chair. <laughs> Sorry to disturb you. You looked very busy. Um, oh, he's got a backpack. No, I don't want to inspect it. I want to equip it. A shiv, um, a phone, random junk, okay, and down he goes. <laughs> and some antiseptic, don't drink it. I think we can use that for uh, crafting. Here's our crafting menu right here, which looks pretty limited at the time being. Yeah, right here we can make um, we can make a bandage with cloth and antiseptic. We have a crafting bench here too, which will open up some more. Crafting um, recipes, most likely. There's some more cashish. We have, oh, Binox. That's nice. Put that down here in a Binox slot, of course. Oh, GPS. Yay. Shows a bird's eye view of your current surroundings. Changes between maps. Uh, I'm not sure what that means. Does that mean there's more than one map? Maybe. All right, let's put our skull mask on, which goes right here. Uh, oh, yeah. Looking mighty intimidating now, Mr. Grimes. I think if we hit V, we have a camera view which is pretty cool this reminds me of um fallout 76 but i don't see any poses are there poses i don't know let's just take a photo oh hope that works there we go cool all right well that's fun um as far as i know it's only single player right now i don't know if multiplayer is going to be added or anything but that's something you can look up on the steam store page is somebody coming oh yeah hi scuba scuba guy this is scuba guy <laughs> Where's the water at, bro? We can take a look at the map here in a second. Oh, yeah, it's really a scuba guy. Oh, shoot. Dang it. He bit me. But I didn't take much damage. What's this? Sharp blade. We could probably use that in some crafting. Um, ooh. Sounds like a storm is coming. Let's get back inside. Let's check out the GPS. There we go. So where are we? Oh, we're right here over in the eastern end of the map. We can zoom in. we got a safe zone right here. We should go check that out. We got Grain Valley. We got Forward Operating Base Alpha. Although that is um, that could be a radi radiation zone. I know that um, there's like dead zones on the map, and we can't go there without a, a gas mask. We have got Elwood up here. So yeah, it's a, looks like it's a pretty good sized map. Oh, Trader Joe's. Let's go there. I love their peanut butter. But first, let's make sure we have 
um, looted everything here. Check it out. We got a flashlight and some gasoline. So vehicles are in the game. So we're going to keep our eyes open for that. It'd be much nicer to get around with a car if possible. Oh, well, hi. Sorry, ma'am. Is this your place? All right, we're going to go. So you do get experience when you kill the zombies, but um, the, like the RPG skills and stuff are not implemented yet. So I'm not even sure it's worth fighting her if I don't have to, but why not? We'll just practice our fighting skills. Oh, she was looking up at something. And, oh, they do drop stuff too, so it might be worth fighting them. Uh, holy cow, that rain is loud. Let's turn that down a little bit. That must be ambient. Yeah. Excellent. All right. Let's go check out this house over here. Apartment, whatever it is. Nothing in the fridge. Nothing in the sink. Um, what is this? Oh, a money pouch. Keep all your money here. Nice. So we can just drag and drop that in there. Oh, yeah. Check it out. <laughs> Uh, that's cool. We got a little 3D representation. Uh, how do we get my money back out? That's the question. We got a nice bandage and some more cloth so we can make more bandages. Actually, can we do that right now? Can we craft? Uh, no, we need one more cloth. I was thinking maybe we could strip this down somehow. I'm not sure if you can break material down. Doesn't look like it. So I'm just going to drop it then. We can sell some of this random junk, by the way, like the phone. It's kind of useless other than the fact that we can sell it. Um, there, There's merchants in the game. We just have to locate them. Now, how do I get to the character information screen? I know there is one somewhere. Maybe J for journal? J for journal. Yep, here it is. Okay. Oh, we're Sam. We have a name. Sam. Edward. We're, we're a man. Sheriff man. Uh, we killed four zombies so far. No humans killed. So maybe that means we're going to find survivors we can kill or other players eventually. Um, I do know that the developer is planning on adding bandits. AI controlled bandits at some point. We have not survived a full day yet. And we got the time down here. Um, excellent. All right. And whoops. Hold on. Oh, no, no. Go back. I want to point at things. Here we go. Skills coming soon and quests coming soon. Awesome. All right. Let's head upstairs. The rain's gone. That's nice. Just a quick squall. Oh, punching for some reason. We got a water bottle and a lamp. Ooh. Yeah, we can set up a camp outside somewhere. That'll be nice. We got a trucker's hat. Let's throw that on the head. All right. Well, the sun's shining again. That's nice. Let's take a look at our GPS and figure out where to go. I think we should continue on down this road. Take a left. We'll go down to Grain Valley. It looks like a nice big town. So, yeah, let's do that. Can we check these cars? Yeah, these are not drivable. There are some cars we'll be able to, that we will be able to fix up and gas up and drive. So hopefully we find one of those because this walking is for the boys, if you ask me. All right, we got a cop car here. Ammo container. Oh, that's very nice. 308 rounds, 556, five, and unfortunately, shift click doesn't seem to work. Oh, it does. Okay, you have to hold down control shift, uh, control click. Shift click is the usual standard, isn't it? So what is that thing? Survival backpack. Wow, that thing's sick. Found it in the trash. All right, let's put all this. Can I, can I click back the other way? Doesn't look like it. You can only click one way. All right, much nicer. Look at that. Six by eight. All right, excellent. Lots and lots of space. Oh, nuclear military site. That does not sound good. Okay, I think we want to turn here. Oh, I'm in radiation. We're going to have to cut through the woods. Yeah, we don't have a gas mask to go that way. All right, we're getting close. Oh, there it is. There it is. Grain Valley. It's a nice little town. It's nestled here in this uh, little valley. Let's just get down there. One piece. Whoa, I'm sliding. <laughs> okay, that was fun. Wee. Oh, that was not fun. Ow, my knees. All right, let's let's uh, let's back it up here. We have attracted some attention from the Zambi. Take this feller out. So I'll be killed. Yes, indeed. Some monies. Uh, just drag and drop that in there. And a book. Looks like a Bible. Oh, there's the there's a, a pile of logs right there. In fact, I don't have an axe to get any. 
but that's how you get the wood that you use for fortifying. Down she goes. We've got a flashlight. That's worth 300, so that we're going to take an antiseptic. Oh, great. Let's do some crafting. Our first crafting, we can make a military grade gaw. Oh, wait, can we? Oh, no, we need one more cloth. Okay, my bad. And there's our cloth. That's what we're looking for. All right, let's make our uh, medicated gauze pad here. Don't need it right now. We can stack it up with that one. And so far, we're looking pretty good. Although, why don't we eat something here? What do we have? We have canned sketty. All right, let's eat the paschetti. And we have a little bit of water. Oop. Wow, drink the whole thing. All right, looking good. Although it's getting dark, let's turn on our flashlight. Uh, it's not the best flashlight, <laughs> but it's gonna have to do. It's really hard to aim with this thing. <laughs> there is a first person mode, but it's experimental and apparently it can cause issues. So we're not going to do that. Um, oh, hold on, let's finish this zombie off and then we'll try one of our gauze pads. Ow. Use it. Okay. We could really use a car. I'm not sure if we're going to get one here in town, but let's check out this garage. Maybe this one. Oh, we have gas, right? Yeah, we do have some gas. Because the cars are going to require two things. Um, gas and potentially repair kits to fix them up. Just a, just a general repair kit. Bolt cutters. Ooh, that's going to be good for breaking into, uh, like, gun cases and stuff, maybe. Or through fences. I don't know. Another money pouch. You can sell it. Painkillers. Okay, that's good. And the flashlight again we can sell. Here's a nice table. Yeah, we need to place. We need to find a place to settle down. We can craft some things, like fence posts, I think, which means we can set up a camp outside somewhere, which we might get to. I don't know if we'll get to that in this episode, but if you want to see more, let me know. Leave a like on the video. We can keep playing. Would like to find a gun at least. Try some of the gunplay. Dead Polly had pretty good gunplay, and I'm assuming it's the same in this one. Oh, wow. Lots of good stuff here. Canned corn. Oh, stairway up the back. Uh, oh, wow. Look at all this water here. Very nice. Now, we can make a door. That much I know, and I think we can block that off with the door at least. Hold on. Let's have a look at the crafting and see what we can build as far as fortifications go. We can make a cooking fire, which is stones and scrap metal. We can make a sleeping bag with some cloth. We don't have any more cloth right now. Crafting bench with wood and scrap metal. So I think the first thing we need to make is a sleeping bag so we can sleep through the night. Let's go try to find some cloth. Oh, is that a, that's a window or something there. Dang it. What is she doing? Get her. Well, her back is turned. All right. What do we got here? Oh, we got a rifle. Hunting rifle. It's a 308. Perfect for long range. Yes, indeed. We got a clipboard, which is junk. Junky knife and a pipe wrench, which looks like it's a melee weapon. Ooh. All right. Let's try it out. Hits a little harder. Uses a little bit more stamina, but it does more damage, which could be very good for us. I'm just going to drink that right out of there. Drop the cash in here. Luggage. Oh, look at that. Oh, cowboy hat. Ranger hat. Yeah, we need that. If we're going to be uh, Rick Grimes, got to go with the cowboy hat. Oh, someone in the alley. It's a punk in the alley. Let's take him out. This thing does a lot of damage, doesn't it? it uses a little more stamina, but it hits harder. I like it. These two thugs in the alley both have knives. <laughs> They were going to try to uh, try to rob us, weren't they? Oh, here we go. Big old med kit. And I'm just going to eat the Skeddy right out of the uh, vending machine. Eat that one as well. It's back here. Oh, stairs going up. Yeah, another vending machine. Yeah, just a bunch of random stuff here. I mean, obviously, there's plenty of food and water to go around. So that's not much of a problem. Uh, oh, vehicle repair kit. We might need that if we find a car that's in 
bad shape. Uh, I'm gonna grab these storage crates so we can set up a, a camp somewhere. I'm gonna have to very soon because we're getting we're getting full here. Oh wow, it's snowing here in the valley. I guess because we're uh, up in the mountains. Oh, here we go. Nine millimeter magazine. We don't have a nine millimeter weapon though. We don't have any sidearm. I'm gonna change those glasses. They're way cooler. Hunter hat and a schmog. Aha! Shotgun! Very, very nice. But do we have any shotgun shells? Okay, had to do a little bit of shuffling to get this shotgun in here. Unfortunately, we do not have shotgun shells to use, but I don't want to pass up that shotgun. Um, by the way, we do have 308 rounds. Can we just drag and drop? Ooh, oh, 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 yes, we can! Okay, great. So we have one round in our hunting rifle. We just put one in the chamber. But we need to find a magazine for that. I think we double click. Yeah, here we go. Um, we need a magazine. They call it a loader here. But we don't have that. So I can't just press R to reload. We have to drag and drop. <laughs> oh, hi. Ooh. Oh, that shot twice for some reason, <laughs> didn't it? Only had one bullet in it, but it shot twice. Oh, here we go. We got a Winchester 45. Perfect for Rick Grimes, isn't it? Although I don't think Rick Grimes had a 45 revolver, but we'll take it. Now, can I just reload this with my R key? Uh, nope. R does not work for reloading, which is very strange. Oh, boy. Hold on. You got company. Holy cow. Are you kidding me? One shot to the brains. Didn't kill him. Leveled up to level four. Oh, here we go. Nine millimeter. Wow, we're getting all the guns now. I guess we can just drop some of these flashlights. Uh, oh, hold up. We got company. Over here, buddy. Bonk. <laughs> and down he goes. All right, hold on a sec. Now, we do have a... We have a nine millimeter magazine. We call it a clip. I'm going to drop the uh, revolver, which I hate to do since we are... Um, Rick Crimes. We can put the magazine here and we can reload the mag with 9mm rounds. Oh, maybe we have to do that here. Let's try. Yeah, there we go. 18 rounds in the mag. Oh, now we're talking, baby. Woohoo! I do want that Winchester too. We can hang on to that. We have just enough space. All right. Now we're talking. Now we can just shoot our way out of town and go find a car. And maybe a place to live. <laughs> we'll set up a little camp. Oh, wait a second, though. I want that sleeping bag. Although I can make a sleeping bag, right? Um, it needs five claws. Uh, I'm going to grab the sleeping bag, but I, ha but I have to drop something here. Darn. Well, I'm going to drop the shotgun. It just takes up too much space. And we don't have any shotgun shells anyway, so that's fine. All right, let's turn off that light. Okay, now, let's get out of Dodge. Ooh, hold up, we got a hunting store here. Let's try to take these fools out. Kind of crazy, this thing takes more than one shot to the head. No mags found. Do I have to do this every time? I'm going to take the magazine out to reload it. All right, one in the chamber and 18 in the mag. Very nice. What do we got here? Rope. Water. I'm just going to drink. I guess we'll grab the rope. Junky laptop. This is not a gun store. The GPS. Those sell pretty well. Oh, hi. Found me. Oh, yeah. 9mm rounds. All right. Well, let's head toward Trader Joe's, I guess. It doesn't look like there's much between here and there. But uh, maybe we can find... A, uh, a trader near Trader Joe's. That's, more, that's what I'm thinking. And we can keep our eyes open for a place to settle down and fortify. Here we have a cop shop. Ooh, baby. There's got to be some ammo in here. All right, well, let's open up. Let's open up. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. These headshots should kill one shot. Whew, okay. Down to three rounds in the mag. Wow. 
That's a lot of shots to take out a zombie. Headshot should do way more damage, in my opinion. Oh, what did I just do? All right, let's go check out the cop shop. Although, I'm going to get a nice headshot with a rifle. See if this can, can take this guy out. With one shot to the noggin. 121 damage, and he's still standing. Oh. Right, so we killed that guy, though, which is interesting. Oh, my gosh, there's a ton of zombies here. Switch back to the handgun, not playing around. Double tap! Oh, here's one in the chamber right here. Oh, cool. <laughs> That's cool. I didn't notice that before. Alright, we got one Zambi here left. I'm gonna take him out with a wrench. Oh! Stuck on something. And I'll just drink your water. Okay. Maybe we are now cleared to go in. Let's go see what kind of loot we got in a cop shop. So eventually there's going to be, uh, like I said, NPC bandits. There's going to be quests. And there'll be, um, and we'll have skills that we can work on. Break open for emergency acts, which I shall do. Well, there we go. 35 damage, 12 uh, stamina drain. Okay, it hits harder. It uses a little more stamina. But we will be able to use that for, uh, whoop, did I get um, for chopping down trees, the wood piles, rather. Let's go upstairs, and then I think we're going to try to go find a car. Oh, check it out. We got lockers, and we can open them up with the bolt cutters. I think that was in the tutorial. <laughs> Holy smokes, look what we got here. Oh, it's a 308 loader. Yes. Excellent. Put that there, and now we can load that up. Hold six rounds. Oh, we can't do it there. Okay, move it over here. Load it up, put it in the gun, and there's our 12-gauge loader. Unfortunately, we left the 12-gauge behind. It is a cry and shame. I'd love to try the shotgun. Military crate. Store all your items here. Wow. Moving stuff around here. And how about that Spec Ops helmet? Is that going to give us night vision? Oh, yes, night vision. Fantastic. And I'll take the loader just in case we get another shotgun. And that's a small military backpack, so we're not going to take that. Oh, look at the loader on the side of the uh, the rifle there. On the It's on the stock. Pretty cool. Let's see what we got here. Wow, a makeshift LMG drum. We do not have a light machine gun, so that doesn't really help us. Oh, a compensator. Can we put that on our... Oh, this is a 308. It's for a 762, so we'll just grab it, and maybe we'll find a another rifle somewhere. Um, I'd love to have this thing. It's 100 rounds of 5.56. Can't really pass that up, can we? <laughs> Let's bring it just in case. We can get rid of one of our med kits. But yeah, we, we need to go and get settled down somewhere. We're just overloaded with the loot. Scrap metal, we need that. I'm going to drop the... Um, oh, shoot. Can't even carry it. Uh, holy cow. We need space. We need this for crafting. So we're going to grab it. And a paint roller. Interesting. Okay. Let's go. Let's go find a car. Can we check this out yet? No. Let's drink it. Okay. Now let's go find a car. So we want to go to the right toward Trader Joe's. And hopefully we can find a trader down there. And now our rifle has um, it's got six rounds. Oh, we got a pickup truck here. It was in an accident. But it looks like uh, we can fix it up, maybe. And there's a sedan here, too, that's sort of smoking. <laughs> oh, holy cow, I can just push this right out of the way. All right, uh, it looks like it could use a little repair. We do have a repair tool, and it's filled up with gas, so we don't even have to use our gas. Um, well, let's hop in. Oh, perfect, baby. We got a pickup truck. This is so great. Hang on a sec. Hang on, hang on, hang on. What is this? This might make a nice little first base. We can put a door there. We can get up on the roof and do some shooting. I don't know if there's any, like, blood moon type thing at night. There's a tent right here, too, in the trash. And a lovely baseball bat. Holy cow. All right, we got all, we got all kinds of goodies here. All kinds of goodies. Um, gas. Yeah, we're going to have to get set up right here. And I can run back to the cop shop and grab the um, those wooden crates. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. Oh, 
I need this. <laughs> I don't know why I put it in there. I'm going to put this out. So let's place it in the world. You just right click, choose place, and then, all right, let's put this in the corner over here. Oh, oh, I just did a roll. I didn't know you could roll. That's cool. Plop that down. Excellent. Now we can just transfer stuff over that, but I can't transfer over with a shift click or any kind of click. So <laughs> we'll just drag and drop it the old fashioned way. All right, we got a couple of different lights here that we can use. So let's try that out. We got the wall light. I guess we can just pick that right up. Can we rotate that too? Yes, we can. I'm going to put it on this wall right here. Is that flush? I can't tell. Holy smokes, that thing's loud. <laughs> Perfect. We can pick it back up again and bring it with us. That's nice. There's also a, a lamp, which we can probably place down on the floor somewhere, but we're not going to do that at the moment. Um, I'm just going to make a little bit of space, and then we're going to take a quick drive down the road and see if we can find a trader. All right, let's hop in the pickup truck and roll on down the road. And we'll come back here for uh, our base. We'll set up a, a door, maybe, if we can. Whoa! Oh, gosh, look at my radiation. Why is it so low? Hold on a sec. I didn't notice it was going down. Where was it going down? I think we're going to have to use some of these painkillers. Oh! Hold on a sec. What is this? Can I drive that? Yes, we can. It's an SUV. I'm going to get it. Whoa! Uh, somebody open the window. I'm going to get car sick. No! Oh, my gosh. Okay. Well, now I have no idea where I am. And I'm going to smoke an SUV. Eh... Uh, Got some gas, but it's going to blow if I don't repair it. I better repair it. Apparently, we have discovered a bit of a bug. Now, where the heck are we? All right, we, didn't, we didn't fly that far. We're right here. We can go right back down to Trader Joe's. Let's see if we can find this trader. Let's get back on a road. <laughs> go back at the gas station. Let's hit this guy. <laughs> Traffic cop. I break for cops. The live ones anyway all right and there's our pickup truck but we'll just stick with the suv for now it's also very nice trader joe's is in the woods this must be a trader check it out hi friendly i think we can put our gun away yep there we go with the x key hello everybody check it out wow we got darren we got kathy you guys trade who's the trader here he is, junk trader. Awesome. Okay, well, he does have a lot of junk, doesn't he? But we can sell stuff to him, right? Um, where's my money going? Is it going into my pouch? Yes, it is. Excellent. All right, so we have over a thousand uh, monies. What can we, we can buy? Oh, we can buy a pistol suppressor for 900. Now we can go into town and be super quiet. I'm going to buy that suppressor. Thanks, pal. And now we can put it on our sidearm. Yep, in the muzzle slot. And look at that. Shows up right there. Does it show up on the gun, too? Oh, it does. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, sorry. Yeah, let me put that away. Sorry, everybody. All right. Well, I think this is a good place to call it quits. Oh, there's a crafting station here, too. Ooh-wee. Look at all the stuff we can make. Let's go chop down some uh, some wood piles. Oh, we can make vehicle repair kits. That's nice. Spike wall, wooden fence, and doors. Yeah, so we can fortify, um, but we can't really build a whole shelter yet. I think that's coming in the future. We can make a bear trap. So I think what I might do is collect some wood off camera and be ready to do some building in the next episode because I definitely want to keep playing and see more of the map and what this game has to offer so yeah let me know down in the comments if you want to see more leave a like on the video and we shall continue now we got some meat that we can cook so i'm assuming there's animals in the game i didn't see any animals but it looks like we can hunt i want to try my night vision hold on a sec <laughs> let's leave trader joe's there we go and his night vision and it's well it's very very green oh there's some wood let's go get the wood Grab my axe and smash it. Yep, that works. 
Wood chunks are flying all over the place. Excellent. All right, let's pick that up. This is apparently an endless supply of wood, so I'll take as much as I can. I don't think there's any weight limits or anything implemented yet, but I'll have enough for next time and we'll do some crafting. Oh boy, what is that? Big storm coming. Oh boy. All right, you know what? I'm going to head home. I'm not staying at this camp because there's no roof. I don't want to get wet. All right, all gassed up, ready to go. Let's crank up the lights. I don't want to drive with night vision. Oh, am I stuck on something? Let's get on the road, head back home where we can call it quits. Oh boy, clip that tree. All right, here's our base. Whoa, 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 whoa. Got to get those brakes checked. Probably shut the light off too. Although there's no battery in it, is there? I don't think so. Oh, I should have made a door. Should have made a door at the camp. I think we can make our own crafting bench anyway. Yeah, let's make a crafting bench. Excellent. And we can place that down. There we go. And now we can make a door. Um, no, we can't make a door. We need more scrap metal. <laughs> Put my sleeping bag down as well. And I believe there was a tent in the trash here. I'm going to grab that tent and the baseball bat. The tent we can place down. And then just use it as storage. Very cool. Alright. Now I'm going to head back inside. And call it a day. Sadly, I cannot put up a door. But we'll do that in the next episode. Oh, we can sleep too. Through the night. Sure. I'll see you in the morning. A.K.A. the next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day. Bye-bye. And good night. All right, it's now morning, 7 a.m., and it looks like the sun is shining. It's going to be a beautiful day. Another day to live through. Better get started. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day. Bye-bye.